Right, one more video to do of the candy. Um, I think this is going to be the last video. Probably being sold. I'm going to do one of these cycles, uh, the 13 minute cycle with two load, well, two towels, bath sheets that I need to refresh that are new. And you're watching Florence Ballad A3060 on film. Right, as I always say, straight into it. Got Dr. Bettman colour on sheet. Because these are new, so they're going to bleed a lot of their colour. So we've got a nice blue bar sheet and a yellow one. I'm getting new towels. These are from Tesco. And uh, I'm getting colours of the London Underground. So that's the Piccadilly line and the Circle line. I'm going to use a Fabulosa, Fantabulosa fragrance. Um, fragrance beads. Fragrance boosted. A lot smaller than regular ones. Hang on, hang on. Alright, that's uh, Via there. And also using some Fairy. So turn this around onto these special cycles. It can be done at 40 degrees and we can have a maximum 1400 RPM. You select the time by selecting the soil level, so 14, 30 and 44. So do 30 minutes and drying of course on this is going to be cover dry, which essentially is extra dry. I think the settings are a bit out on this one and that'll come out nice and fluffy. Pump out and let's begin. Part of my car over that side now, over there, because oh, the, no. that Fiat, I don't know what it is, is webs oh, all over no. the side of it. Which Fiat is that? That Fiat 500, the white one. On the other side of it, connecting to that um, box, or that Citroen, no, there's a box on it. Mm. There's a massive web now, I don't know if it's something through the bushes there or whatever, so. Oh, no, no. What I'm saying? So did you. Yeah, fair enough. Oh, I don't know, I don't know how long you were singing then. I'm just not missing. That everyone knows it's you. It's not. It's not me. Oh, it's got a little towel wash doing the wheeler as well. Some rags. If there's anything private you've got to say, just... Oh, I'm not typing it. No, no, wait, I'll be done in a second. Oh. Just wait a second. Good, so again, uh, straight into it. I'm hoping this load will balance properly. They're both exactly the same size, so. Thank you. 
Oh, draining. I don't know if it, I think this is an intermediate spin. See the level that we're going to do. It will be very salty, of course, because this version is salty. It's sort of just like there on the seal, but the suds are hiding it. So it does do it's immediate drain. Um, yeah, this is the thing I don't like about the program on this. If you're on a water meter, I mean, I'm not, but still, it's wasting a lot of water doing it because it's not even effectively rinsing. So, yeah, the machine will be put up for sale after this. I'll give the machine a rinse out and then. Uh, Pump something new in that I've got, but yeah.
think that's all it'll do for the level. Which is good because it doesn't dilute the fabric conditioner too much. Oh no. suspension bounces on these. Oh, this does a bit of a higher level. Yeah, no, just to the top of the door sill. That's good for a small load. Literally about 30 seconds or 10 seconds later after uh, 20 seconds later off stop the filming. Going straight for the final spin. Than that. No, 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 no. There's no way it's going to spin that. What? Fair play. Didn't bounce around. Chuck it at a 14 on the bar. I'll just spend that to come forward. One 
mountain.
recycle because the other tile is still stuck on the side. Needs to say we don't waste time doing the thermal spin. Oh, there you go. You can see all the dirt from the the fluff from the um, towels. That's why you should always wash your towels first before using them. And also bleeds out any of the colour. Well, we've sensed down to one hour of drying. It should be enough for this. Should be perfectly dry. Then I'll give the machine final rinse out, wipe everything down, and then we'll take some pictures and get ready to sell. He says towels be nice already now.
Right, we're on the cooldown now. You can tell that the load is definitely dried, so it'd be nice to see the final result when that comes out. And I've, I've already brought a new appliance into the house, which is going to be swapped around with this. videos it's so cheap on that is. Was it five? I don't know how long I've done now. Was it four? I don't know how I've done this. We did the first one, then we did No, it's the fourth video, fourth video that we did. Cottons. Yeah, so four videos of what I need to get out, five or six is a bonus, but it's just I don't really have time to film this because the washer dryer, so the cycles take long. This is meant to have actually been cottons pre-wash uh, cottons 40 and pre-wash or something, but I had no time before work to do that. Right, end of the cycle. Oh yes, there's loads. Oh wow. <laughs> it's green as well, it's a mixture of yellow and blue. It's making a colour. Oh god, yeah, there's still some on the. Uh, but. Oh, wow. Oh, so warm and so soft. That is unbelievably soft. Wow, amazing. And there's your proof that it captured the colour. That's what's coming out of it. So guys, that's the end of this candy machine. The smart CBD485D1E slash 1-80 integrated washer dryer with a 1400 RPM spin and a 8 kilogram wash and 5 kilogram drying capacity. It's an integrated model, as you know, that's why it's got these stubs here at the side for the uh, cupboard to go on. No one injured themselves in that, luckily. Um, I will be putting this through a rinse and spin a little later and then selling it. Um, it's, been, it's been a good machine in a way to film. Not the best programmed in some ways, although there were some cycles like synthetics are a bit better and the quick cycles were good, but I think they sort of took away some things since like the Hoover 6 and whatnot. Um, and then sort of added things. I like the idea that there isn't a thermo spin during drying, so it gets things dried quicker and not as creased. In fact, if anything, it irons out the creases for us because some of these towels have come out creased in other washer dryers. Um, the only thing is, though, is that god awful whiny motor. I mean, I am a lover of brush motor, and as a collection guy for my collection, I will only ever accept brush machines, I absolutely cannot stand inverter or quiet machines, but even this was unbearable for me at times. You can hear it all the way from upstairs with, the, with my bedroom door closed. That's how I knew when it was about to kick into spin and come down and see it. So that's that done. I'm going to do a load of towels later in the mealer, but before I go, I'm just going to show you what we're bringing in next. There probably won't be any videos of this because of what appliance it is. That's what I've got. This came for free from uh, literally, and I say it was about three roads down, I can count three roads away. It's a Hot Point Aquarius DWF50 uh, in polar white. It's got blue Hot Point badge. It's from the WMA range, although it has got the style like the WF models. Uh, picked up for free, not sure if anything's wrong with it or anything. I haven't tried it yet, I'm gonna plumb it in. But unfortunately, as you know, being a dishwasher, there's no way to film anything. I can do an overview, but what I will do is like a one hour or two hour ASMR video of this where I just put the camera up against the door and you just get to hear the sloshing of the water because I really love how dishwashers sound um, and then I'll just sell this on 
Um, I think it's made by Medea, I think, according to Chris, but I've got to run it through a, a, a clean out later. It's got some good cycles on it. So hey, it'll be the first time I get a dishwasher in this house. <laughs> It'd be interesting to see. So yep, yeah, I got that. It's got some stickers. Um, I'll probably keep them for my collection. That's the serial number there. I don't know if anyone can work out a date code from that or anything. Uh, I don't know where it is on this machine. Is it at the side? Yes, it is. How are we going to put that? Made in EU. Yeah, it'd be interesting to see what a dish was like. It, I mean, that is so reminiscent of my WMA64. It's probably pretty from the range after. It's quite a big one. Um, but yeah, so I've got my dish, I've got dishwasher tablets and rinse aid and whatnot in the cupboard. So that was the candy, that's going to be moved out afterwards and I'll take some photos um, tonight because I've also got to rinse this out and then that'll be it. Hope you guys enjoyed this and those who didn't, yep, I don't blame you, uh, but it was nice to have this. Um, there is a new machine I have seen nearby, but I'm just waiting for the seller to respond. It's free and it's near, um, it's in Fulham actually, it's near where my nanny is. Um, but what I'll just say, it's something a little bit older, um, but albeit not the most interesting but yeah we'll see what it what happens thank you very much for watching and don't forget to keep it supreme and go with the flow